We're gonna build six Thor kettlebells. Woo wee! Yeah. I go in. <laughs> We're gonna build six Thor kettlebells. Thor, Mjol Mjolnir bells. Mjolnir kettles, kettlebell. Hammer bells. Hammer bells. We got these hammers from Medieval Depot. And if you guys wanna build your own Mjolnir project, whether it's a heavy Thor hammer, electromagnetic Thor hammer, or you name it, we've made so many Thor hammers over the years. Check the link in the description below. We got a coupon code for you too, so you can pick up one of these Mjolnirs from MedievalDepot.com. Six hammer bells. We're gonna have a 10 pound, a 20 pound, a 30 pound, 40 pound, 50 pound, and a 75 pound, just like our old lead filled hammer, which I believe we have right here. This it's hammer apart. has seen some better days. But when we made this hammer, we quite literally just poured molten lead into it without really thinking about how to actually make it a strong hammer. Let's take one apart and uh, we'll go from there. So yeah, that thread rod is way too thin. We're gonna have to actually put a real handle inside of these. As you can see, that's where it failed. Let's so, hop over to the lathe. Yeah. We have our solid steel handles now. Well, let's start with a 10 pounder. So how much does one of these even weigh out of the box? It's looking at about 8.1 pounds. Yeah. All right, why don't we put all the pieces on there and see how close we can get. So we got this. Still have these guys. Still have this. This guy. Two of these. One of those. 6.9 pounds. Woo! It's gonna be close. Woohoo! 10.3 pounds. That's, uh, eh. I feel like real Olympic weights aren't even like, Exactly. Yeah. Let's see if a 10 pound Olympic weight is yeah, actually yeah. 10 pounds. I'm, I'm kind of curious. All right. I mean, look, look how different all these are. They're cast 10 pound weights. If we go with measure, I'll grab a rubber coated one too. Let's see if these are actually 10 pounds. Let's start with one of these cast ones. Hmm. 10 pounds exactly. Let's try this one. Ha, 9.5 pounds. Let's see what this rubber bumper plate is. 10 exactly. Either way, one out of three didn't even weigh 10 pounds. It's off by 0.5 pounds. So I think we're okay. Okay, put that one back together then. You know I love Norse mythology. I mean, what? This is like my 10th Thor hammer video, right? That's why I was super excited to be one of the ambassadors for the Rise of Kingdoms Ultimate Civilization Championship. Representing the Vikings, it's Hack Smith! Tonight, I'll show you just how mighty my battle axe is. my What, those toy shields of yours? Mark a barbarian? Don't toss Caesar salad. Stop and let the players decide who the victor is themselves. In the final round, I got to star as an epic Viking chief, going toe to toe with just us in a fight for the Romans. Here's the deal. Rise of Kingdoms is a super fun strategy game with true multi-civilizations. Choose one of 12 civilizations, each with unique buffs and talents to counterattack, to form your empire, and change history. Download the game using my link below and join alliances along with 100 million players worldwide. You also get the chance to win prizes like an iPhone 13 or AirPods Pro. If the Viking players rank highest on December 20th, Just Dustin will pour tons of slime on himself. But if the Romans rank higher than me, well, I've agreed to have my chest waxed by the power loader. Please don't let him win. Download Rise of Kingdoms for free right now and vote for my civilization, the Vikings. Peace. Hold it in place. And then we go straight to these guys, I guess. Yeah. Looks yeah, good. Screws on over top and holds it all, compresses it all together. So now we have a 10 pound hammer. Onto the 20 pound hammer. So let's melt down some lead. So as you know, we sell mini sabers at Hacksmith.store. These awesome little butane powered blow torches the size of a normal blow torch. What, what is this, a mini saber like a, camp stove? Yeah, camp stove. Woo. Hot, that works, fits in perfectly. Over our, our stove. That's good enough. This is the leftover lead from our original Thor's hammer. 
and it's not, not near enough lead. So I went ahead and bought scrap lead. These are, these are diving weights. Let's melt them down. Got a nice steel plate that we're gonna put on top of the scale to protect the scale. There's the soup coming. Getting warm. Oh yeah. Wow. That's trippy. There's barely, there's barely anything in it, but it's like all sloshy and stuff. So we wanna hit 20 pounds. 18.2, 18.5, 18.9. Just a little, oh, 20 pounds on the dot. Nice work, Ian. Oh, right. Well, this one cools down. Let's make the next one. All right, we're on to the 30 pounder. Woo wee. All right, we're up to 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 28.3, 28.7, 29.6, 29.8, 29 29.9, stop. 30 pounds. 30 pounds, all right. Nice. There we go. Woo! We've got the 10, 20, 30, and 40 pound hammers, so let's try our biggest one yet, a 50 pounder. We got two pots going here because one was not melting it fast enough. So we're just making sure the handle's perfectly straight with the first layer of lead before we go ahead and fill it up fully. We're not sure we're gonna have enough lead for all the hammers we're going to try and make, so we're actually gonna use a bit of steel for the weight in the 50 pound one. We're up to 28 pounds. Woo wee! 35, keep going. We got lots. 36, keep going. 44, 45, 48, 49, 50. Perfect. All right, so next step. Don't need to weigh this one at all. We're just trying to get it as heavy as possible. Don't want any, ah. Let that solidify. Is it solid? It's solid. Oh, baby, keep going, keep going, keep going. Yeah, look at that pour. So we gotta fill the top part as well. We're gonna try and fill it right to that edge. And we're gonna fill this right to that inner edge. And then they should still go together and be as heavy as possible. That's probably good. Keep going. -wee. All right, slow down, slow down. Let's cut this off. To the milling machine. You do Y, I'll do X. Not too shabby. Cool. Perfect. Teamwork milling. Hey Bogdan, you missed it. We did teamwork milling. Yeah. Moment of truth. Let's Will see if it fit? fits. And then how much does it weigh? I can't imagine it's gonna be wet. like the old one was 73. Well, let's see. Let's see. It's, it, the lead is more pure. Lead is more pure, okay. What number? 75. I'm gonna say 74. Hey! Oh my god. Oh! Oh! 77.6! Before we pack up, we should make one more. One more? One more. Because our old hammer, we want one nice one for the gym. True. And one new. Smashy hammer. Smashy hammer. A fun hammer. But should the smashy hammer really be 75 pounds? Well, that can be the smashy hammer, and we'll make another one that's actually exactly, exactly 75. 75. Okay, okay. Just have to wait for these to cool down, and we can put the aesthetic stuff back on. And we will uh, have some Thor kettlebells. We ran out of lead, so we're going to salvage the old hammer. I cut it in half, and I thought this was really cool. You don't see it. You can see the layers. This is where we poured the molten lead in, and it didn't bond completely to the previous layer. There you go. Melt that down. We've got all our Thor kettlebells finished, and we thought- One bonus hammer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we got the ultimate Thor dumbbell. How much does that weigh, Ian? 155 pounds. Whew. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, <laughs> that's, that's pretty heavy. Me. That's heavier than me. That's the same weight as me. Me or the hammer. <laughs> anyway, we thought it would be fun to do a little challenge for the team here at Hacksmith Industries. So 
we want to see who here is worthy. Basically, how it works is you get to pick which hammer that you want to try lifting. And if you can hold it up, like Thor, like so, you win. You win. But you only get one, one chance. chance. Should we uh, call some contestants over? Yep. Chris. Chris, get over here. All right, Chris, the game is simple. Prove yourself worthy and take the money home. Which are you going to try? And this one is 50. You can do 50? Yeah. All right. Oh! Oh! oh. Shoot! <laughs> All right, we got $100. God. That's 200. 200. Oh, 200. Oh, shoot. We made a terrible mistake. We have, we have made a grave error. We have many employees. <laughs> All right, Tyler, get over here. I'll go for this. 40. Oh! <laughs> good attempt, good attempt. Oh, and get over here. All right, you know the rules. Which one are you going for? So <laughs> oh! <laughs> good attempt, good attempt. Tyler, this may come as a surprise to both of you, but I'm not actually very strong. So, can you. Why did we hire you? $1,000. and all I have to do is break my back. All you have to do is break your back. Good deal. We got free healthcare. I'm gonna try third. Oh, he's worthy. Josh, get over here. I wanna see how uh, cocky our content director is. 100 bucks for 40? Ooh. Josh is worthy. 100 bones. <laughs> Mike. Down 50. So you can go big, mm -hmm. but then you go home. Mm. Well, I mean, I'm gonna be going home anyway. <laughs> No one has even touched this one or this one, obviously. 80, right? 80. Uh, question, did Juji Mufu lift the 73 above his head? I don't think he did. Just for perspective. Uh, Roll back that clip. <laughs> How much does this one weigh? 73. I'm curling a 73 pound hammer? <laughs> Pretty strong. Hey Ian, remember that time I tried lifting the 114 pound tungsten oh. Thor hammer? <laughs> Oh, oh, this fell over. Oh boy, that was close. Yeah, I'm gonna give the 50 a shot. <laughs> we are. We, we did not think no this legs. through. We're losing a lot of money. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this, this video is costing more money than uh, we originally planned. All right, Ben, what'll it be? Oh, Ooh, good try, good try. Daryl. Daryl. Get over here. Daryl. Oh. oh. Does that count? I'm rich. Just stable. Yeah. yeah. More, more stable than Daryl. Way more stable than Daryl. Daryl, what are you doing? All right, Caleb, you know the rules. Oh. There you go. Yeah. 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 Ben. <laughs> All right, Bogdan, get up here. Yeah. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> Oh, that's not happening. <laughs> oh! Wow, is that that's, like cheating with the strap? That is, yeah, right, that that is this, this man knows physics. Can I get it on this at some point? Sure. I'll take the camera. Oh! Yeah, yeah. yeah this thing's heavy. <laughs> Haley, you're up. You've been, you've been shipping all those mini savers. <laughs> all the buttons. No. <laughs> How much is this? 20. 20. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Come on up, Aaron. Got one of our high school co ops in, and one hand in the air. Oh! Yeah. All right. Have we missed anyone? Well, I feel like that was a poor financial decision. But you know what's not a poor financial decision? Check out hacksmith.store for some sweet merch. Now it's time to smash. All right. Ah! <laughs> that thing is heavy. <laughs> wow, that glass is sick. Ha <laughs> ha
<laughs> Alright, let's see if we can make a frying pan in. <laughs> Again! Yeah. Ah. What's next? Yeah. <laughs> I, I didn't it. even feel it. I didn't feel it. <laughs> the center of it. Ah. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> we need to uh, let gravity help a bit, Ian. I gotta stand on top of this ladder and do that again. Wow. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta finish this chair though. I think, an, I think another ah. hit from it, maybe. Ah. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> All right, how about, how about something easier? We got a five pound gummy bear. Oh, he's stuck now. <laughs> bye bye, gummy. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. All right, maybe, maybe we should hit him when he's lying down. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, such shock absorption. <laughs> I think it's time for the teeter totter. So let, let's start with something simple. Uh, let's lead up to the people. That's, wow. I want to see this yeet a cinder block in the air. <laughs> let's try that again. <laughs> Hey Mikey, ever heard of concrete skate shooting with an axe? Well, watch and see. Yeah! Right, let's give the teeter totter a break. I think it's time to play with the trampoline. Sounds safe. All right, what, what exactly is your plan here, Ian? I don't really know. Oh boy. Oh God. I don't like this. You broke it, didn't you? No, it's still there. Let's get the skyjack to drop it on the trampoline. Let's go straight through. Are you ready? <laughs> right through. <laughs> We're gonna try putting a piece of plywood down to even out the uh, load from the hammer, hopefully see it mounts. Here we go. Woo! Wow! <laughs> it survived! Another. <laughs> I love the sound. <laughs> oh, man. So now what? Let's, uh, let's use the drop zone now. Neither of us are uh, strong enough to do Thor's hammer justice. So we're gonna let the power loader hold the Thor hammer in the air and we'll do a quick release using this nice little black rope here. And we can drop it on whatever we want from about 16 feet. This is terrifying. All right, I'm going. Woo! Sweet. Right there. Woo! Yes! <laughs> All right, let's set up the big one. We 
we've got 10 layers of tempered glass. This stuff is hard. It's the same stuff they used in Squid Game. Okay. Here we go. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Awesome. Damn. Can you hear that? It's still cracking. I want to see that in slow -mo. It's like instant. The entire piece of glass just Yeah, to see tempered glass actually explode in slow-mo, you need like tens of thousands of frames per second. It's ridiculous. You can't even, there's so it's much just glass you can't, you can't even see the camera. <laughs> all the way, all the way, all the way. Boom. <laughs> that was worth it. <laughs> awesome. That was a ton of fun. If you want to see more Thor Hammer videos, make sure you check out the playlist. And don't forget to click the link in the description below and download Rise of Kingdoms for free right now and support my civilization, the Vikings. Check the link in the description below for more battle details. I really don't want to get my chest waxed by the power loader.